say Roadrunners will have to wait and see what is next for their football team. After finishing the regular season 7-4 and four overall and sitting on top of the West Division and Conference USA at 5-2, and two, the possibility exists of playing for the conference championship and in a bowl game as well. It's been almost one year to the day that Jeff Trailer was hired as the head coach of the Roadrunners, and he led them to their first seven-win season since 2013. The trailer attributes his early success by relying on, among others, his 23 seniors in the program. Obviously, we exceeded so many people's expectations. We're going to really pay for that next year because the expectations are going to be through the roof. Um, but it's just the only way. I think it's my, it's my personal belief what I think is the right thing to do for, for older kids uh, in a program. A lot rides on what UAB does against Rice. UAB needs to lose as far as playing for the conference championship game. One of our big games this Friday night will feature the Lanier Vokes against the Brackenridge Eagles to decide district championship in 13-5A Division I. Forced to play in the COVID-shortened season, the Vokes enter Friday's game leading Zone B in district at 3-1 overall, 3-0 record at Zone B, but their only loss to the Brackenridge Eagles two weeks ago, 21-14. Now the Eagles are undefeated, 5-0 overall, 4-0 in Zone A, playing what is head coach Willie Hall's final year at Brack after 33 seasons, 25 of those as head coach. I know that they're going to come out and play hard just like they did uh, when we played them last. And I know that they don't got no quit in them either, so it's going to be a great game. They have a good team over there. They have good players, you know, good corners, good safeties, defense, offense. They have guys, they have athletes, you know, they have a good coach over there, you know. So they're, they're a great team, but they're going to go against great, a great, great team like us too. Kickoff in Alamo Stadium on Friday night is set for 730. All right, in the wake of former Steel star Caden Stearns opting out of the rest of the season and next to enter into the 2021 NFL Draft, what about quarterback Sam Ellinger? He's a senior and has the option due to NCAA COVID-adjusted rules to return next year as well. Now, he was asked if he thought about opting out early with two games left to play in the regular season against Kansas State in Kansas. After his own offensive alignment, Samuel Cosme also decided to leave the program early. I haven't, um, you know, I, I, while I absolutely love and respect them, I, I, I would never do that. Um, you know, I, I want to finish what I've started here and, um, I want to, I will always give my all for my teammates. Um, and everybody's situation is different. I get that. Um, but I, I wouldn't. Kick off in Manhattan on Saturday is set for 11 in the morning. So we're big Rice fans, is that right? Yes. Okay. Got to have Rice win. Go Owls. Rice beat right. UAB. Beat UAB. Okay. You can do that. Go team. That's no problem. Speaking of go team, they're the go team downtown, right? Yeah. They <laughs> are. Market Square. Hey, guys. And don't cover yours up with your what? script. And we're going to explain what these are all about. Because we so look so look. cool right now if you don't know what these are for. <laughs> I'm glad I wore a blue sweater. <laughs> Yeah, we're going to talk about some uh, games, but first yes. of all, our good buddy Leah Davila is back with us today. Oh, good guys. to see you, sir. And you're talking uh, acorn squash. Acorn squash. So a lot of people aren't really familiar with this squash and don't know what to do with it. Right? Right. So my sister, you know, bought like five of these from a local farmer and didn't know what to do with it. And I was like, just oven roast it. She's like, is it that simple? I don't cook. I was like, it's that simple. So what we did, I just cut off the bottom just to stabilize it. Mm -hmm. And all you're going to do is take a sharp knife, cut it down the middle. And here you go. So there's two ways. We can scoop this out now, or you can scoop it out after you roast it. Oil, salt, pepper, oven, 425 degrees for about 45 minutes to an hour. It's done. That's and it. you're going to make a great kind of a sort of a sauce out of that? Yeah, so instead of doing it like traditional cubes, we're actually going to do a roasted acorn squash puree. Ooh, Ooh that sounds good. And, and he's going to be doing some great comfort food, too. Yes, mm -hmm. indeed. All right, Jen Tobias Trusky is out live and talking about a great charity. What's going on, Jen? Yes. You know the sound of the Salvation Army kettle and the bell. And we are here at the Walmart on the south side. I have Brad here. Give us away, Brad. And we have a celebrity who will be joining us, a familiar face from right here in San Antonio. So stick around. Oh, and we are going to be talking oh, some of on. the really cool gadgets. If you are looking for some great gifts for a great price, and you know what? 
We've got laser tag. We've got road yeah, rage <laughs> speed bumpers. We've yeah. got robot combat. We're going to be showing all that to you. <laughs>
we're doing yeah, this. Yeah, it'll still, it'll still go. Okay, we've got the pigeon. Can I go away? You, you, you <laughs> so, Mike, so. while I start this, on the right side, um, two pork bellies. What we have going on. The left one is what shows up to the first light smoke. So we do a light smoke on the left side. It's a super simple uh, cure, brown sugar, salt, crushed red pepper flakes. The right side is what you're actually gonna cut up today is the fully smoked ready to eat version. Okay. okay. So this is fully smoked. We wrap it, we seal it, we lock in those flavors. And all we wanna do is we wanna put those into cubes. How big a cube? Uh, so one inch by one inch. Okay, so you know, a, good, a good size. Good size, I mean, a, nice, good size. a nice bite, so. And then same thing, what you're gonna do is you're gonna heat up your pan and no oil is needed since pork belly has a nice little fatty component to it. And Fiona, you're basically done over there on that side. Done, Super right. quick, super quick. What I have going is the acorn squash. So the acorn squash, I'm all about, I want to cook the day before when nobody's there, one, to bother me and, you know, get in my way. <laughs> I love my mom helping me cook. I love, you know, different people. But, you know, you're just in your get element. Get out of my kitchen, right? <laughs> pretty much. Um, so now I'm just reconstituting this acorn squash. So we threw a little bit of heavy cream and butter in here. And as you can see, you know, we, we like it silky like the Zohan. That was the main mes message when uh, Chef Hunter cooked this for me is I want it silky smooth. Um, so as you see, we ran it through a, sh uh, a fine mesh strainer, really, really smooth, smooth enough to put in a squeeze bottle, which we're actually gonna plate it with right now. Okay, and, and can you just kind of go, you said that's a, a nice buttery flavor as opposed to the, the, the butternut squash. Yeah. But what kind of spices would you add to it? So acorn squash really is nice to a lot of like honey, cinnamon. Um, if you wanna go a little bit more savory route, red pepper flakes. Uh, Szechuan peppercorns, um, you know, you can, it, it has a natural sweetness to it, mm -hmm. so you can counterbalance with that savory, and that's how we cook. We cook savory and sweet, okay. so this is just a perfect element to go with our hearty pork belly and those greens. All right, very quickly, uh, yeah. the best taco, what was that consisting of there? Uh, so, our best taco, so like I said, our pork belly is what we're known for, and that's exactly what we did. Um, the smoked pork belly, we also do our version of a loaded corn in a cup, so very Fiesta, very San Antonio. Uh, Fiona, if you just want to put the greens kind of right on the side of those. Um, so it's our uh, version of my mom's cream corn. So we did a smoked cream corn, finished it with the hatch green chili picadillo and all the fixing on top. It was like San Antonio in a cup. Where can people find you? Uh, so this weekend, actually this Friday, we're going to be at the St. Paul Square Market, the pop-up. Um, and then just kind of check our Facebook and Instagram. 2020 was a little light for us. But I promise we're on the way 2021. Okay, and I'm going to top this off here. This would obviously go a little bit longer mm -hmm. and just put some of that uh, right there next yeah, to the Yeah, I have some tongs on your left side if you want oh, to use here we go. Okay. And then the last finishing would just be some sesame seeds and some green onions. Okay. And it's beautiful. And if not, there's the finished product right there. All right. Thank you so much, Chef Leo. Now, remember, he isn't done. He's going to make some appetizers for us in just a few minutes. But if you want to learn more, of course, about Chef Leo and catch the wave, just head to our website salive.com and click on the ad scene on SA Live tab. And let me tell you something, he cooked a couple little samples beforehand. Oh goodness gracious, that pork belly <laughs> is delicious. Leo, thank you very much, sir. All right, well this year we all need a little extra magic in the holiday season and your San Antonio Spurs want to help. Yes, indeed. You know, you've probably been driving around your neighborhood seeing some lights, but boy, oh boy, they have, uh, the Spurs have created a winter wonderland adventure for your family. You can safely experience. Fiona and I jumped in our sleighs <laughs> or the, the car and checked it out for ourselves. Check this out. beginning to look a lot like Christmas at the AT&T Center. Oh, it's a veritable winter wonderland out here. And look who we bumped into, the big guy. <laughs> hey, Spurs Coyote, and that's right, Santa, Santa too. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness, four million lights out here in the AT&T Center parking lot. This just sends shivers up your spine. Oh yes, and here to tell us all about the display is John Alvin, owner of Decor IQ and Illuminite. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas Merry to Christmas. both of you. Oh, this is absolutely incredible. And you built light displays for companies and communities all over the country, including right down there at Riverwalk. Everyone has seen those lights. What made you decide to create this display? Because you've designed some of these pieces, right? Yes, ma'am. Um, for me, it was uh, all about just the uniqueness and bringing something back to San Antonio and uh, bringing the community out to a, a socially distanced uh, holiday drive through Okay, you kick it off with, I mean, that, words don't even describe that wreath, and that was made in Spain? Yes, sir. So a lot went into this, uh, from the design to um, just the colors and everything, but the thing that we wanted to is this is the entry point of the whole um, drive through experience, and for, for us, why not go big? It's Texas, right? 
<laughs> so um, for us is a uh, the, the wreath was a, a staple point for everybody to drive through and make it a big 3D element that everybody could experience. Okay, what sort of displays are folks gonna see when they go in there? And, and do you have a favorite? Yeah, so there's all kinds of different um, uh, displays. Uh, three dimensional, we really wanted to go big, go larger than life, kind of take your imagination to a different level. My personal favorite, uh, being from Texas, we're not around snow a lot. So uh, we built a, uh, awning, uh, a snow display that actually shoots snow over all the cars and they get to interact with it. <laughs> oh, fantastic. About how long does it take to drive through? Um, from start to finish, about 40 minutes. Wow. And do you buy tickets online or at the gate? Online. Um, we are really stressing the impact um, of being a social distance and everything will be purchased through Ticketmaster Online. And is there an app that folks can download as part of the experience? Yeah, so um, we have a Illumini app and everything is um, focused in that app. Well, this of course is the season for giving and part of the proceeds from admission here goes to a really good organization. Yes, Jennifer Reckner with Spurs Give joins us and tell us what Spurs Give is up to this holiday season. Sure, I'd love to. Well, since the beginning of the pandemic, Spurs Give has been focused on filling critical needs in the community. And we are bringing Illuminite to the AT&T Center to raise money to give back to the community in the areas of digital divide, mental health, and food insecurity. Enough questions. I, 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 want, to, I want to check it out. Let's go get in the car. Christmas! Yay! This is where the LED lights look good because they do look like ice stalag lights. Oh my gosh! Snow! It's a Christmas miracle! Mike, did you did you predict snow in your forecast? I don't remember you saying anything about it. Illuminite runs now through January 3rd right here at the AT&T Center. For more information, go to salive.com and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. Hey, a big thank you to Ansara Winton Chevrolet for sponsoring our big adventures every month. And for more information, go to ansarachev.com. Still ahead on SA Live. A special at-home performance by a local singer-songwriter you don't want to miss. But first, Jen is live with the San Antonio actress who had her own show on Netflix and see how they're working together to make it a Merry Christmas for less fortunate families. That's next on SA Live. Hey guys, it's April Ansira from Ansira Wind Chevrolet. Thanks for joining us on this month's SA Live Big Adventure. Make sure to watch each month as the SA Live team takes you to new places all over South Texas. And don't forget, and Sirwin Chevrolet can get you on your next big adventure too. Just stop by or visit AntsiraChev.com. Oh, welcome back to SA Live. Well, it's that time of year where the Salvation Army is doing their best to raise money for their annual Red Kettle campaign. Yep, Jen Tobias Trusky is out there and not only uh, helping to raise money, but she's also with the San Antonio actress who has her own Netflix series. Jen. I was like, what? <laughs> Hello, yes, guys, and here she is. It's Paulina Chavez. You may recall we interviewed her not too long ago to talk about her Lifetime movie, which I got to see. It was so good. Oh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys haven't watched it, it's on Lifetime app. And you have another show coming up. But before we get to that, let's talk about your kettle oh, here. Yes. So, um, Mr. Dickerson, he's from Sky Harbor Elementary. He is my savior. He came up with this idea. And I help, but he is the brain to this situation <laughs> right here. Um, he's super talented. He's amazing. So I'm really thankful to have him on my team. Beautiful. And we are so proud of you. Um, I, I keep saying this. I'm going to say it again. We went to the same elementary school yes. from the south side of San Antonio. 
super proud of you. Oh, thank you, thank you so much. I, I appreciate all the support from San Antonio. I absolutely love San Antonio and I'm absolutely grateful to be here. So thank you, Brad, for inviting me. And now let's talk about that show coming up. Yes, Ashley Garcia, Genius in Love has a Christmas special and it comes out December 9th and it's gonna be fun. It's our last episode, so please tune in. It's on Netflix. Perfect, so timely, because that's coming up. So tune in. Now I'm gonna move over here to Mr. Mr. Brad. Thank you, um, Brad. So let's talk about the importance when you see these kettles. We have, um, why it's so important to give a little goes a long way. A little goes a long way, especially this year, the need's greater ah! than ever. And, uh, you know, we have so many people that are helping out any way they can. We have a friendly competition here today that supports the Red Kettle campaign. Regardless of who raises the most money, all proceeds help local families in need. And those are the real winners. And speaking of this friendly competition, KSAT's representation right over here. We have Miss Katie Blake. Hello, Hi. Katie. Good to see you. I never get to see you. I know. I know. This is nice. <laughs> so tell me about your inspiration here. Oh, my gosh. Well, I knew we had to incorporate masks somehow because Yes, yes. Right? Um, and I thought, what better way to tie in the holiday season than to give Santa a mask? So even, even the big guy himself is masking up this <laughs> holiday season. We've had a, I used the glue gun. We've had a few issues with our eyes, but they're safe. <laughs> Yes, the, nothing a tape can't help fix. <laughs> exactly. Thank you, Katie. So we're hoping to, that people will come out here at the Walmart, um, Palo Alto, and I-35. But really quickly, Councilwoman uh, Rocha Garza, is that right? Oh. Yes, with us today. So representing the South Side. Yay, yes. And uh, it looks like we're all Southwest ISD grads. So happy to be here with you yes. all. And thank you for um, doing this and tuning in, everybody. And hope you have a great holiday season. And stop by your local Walmart and support the Salvation Army. Any message you want to give to the community on why they should give back? Yes, it's important to give back because there's so many people in need right now. We know that our experience uh, with COVID-19 has been a little bit drastic. And so we need to make sure that we take every opportunity we can, when we can, to please give back. As little as possible will count. Thank you. Thank you so much. We will be out here now. If you want to catch the Salvation Army this weekend, they are teaming up in Bernie for a Toys for Tags event. You can go out there and you can meet Goldberg, WWE star Goldberg. He will be Santa. Bring an unwrapped new toy or you can give a donation. It all goes back to the Salvation Army. Back to you guys. I love, tell, tell Katie, love the, uh, the kettle that yes. you decorated there. Yes. Mike says he loves a kettle. <laughs> <laughs> She said thank you. <laughs> you know, that's always one of those great sounds of Christmas. The bell. The bell and the, mm -hmm. and the kettle. Of so. course. All right. Hey, still ahead on SA Live, we're testing out some of the coolest gadgets for kids, how you can get your hands on these hot items. And there are great prices, too. Next, taking care of your health is more important now than ever. A local doctor is answering your questions about Medicare straight ahead on SA Live. Hey, this Sunday, December 6th, is the annual Gotcha Covered Collection Drive. They are looking for your new or used clothing, toiletries, non-perishable food, or any items listed on the screen. Help spread kindness this holiday season by donating at the North Park Shopping Center this Sunday, December 6th at 9 a.m. If you haven't enrolled for a Medicare plan, you only have six days left to do it. The deadline for Medicare enrollment period is December 7th. Health Texas Primary Care Doctors and United Healthcare specialize in Medicare Advantage plans and care. And here to tell us more is Glenda Pope with United Healthcare. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. All right. Who qualifies for the dual complete plan? So People who have a limited income or money's a little bit tight or individuals who have Medicare and Medicaid may qualify for United Healthcare Dual Complete Plan. This plan is designed especially for individuals who have special needs. So although requirements may differ from state to state as well as circumstances, you, if you have a family of one making less than $16,000 a year, or a family of two making less than $21,000 a year, you may qualify. When should someone consider a dual complete plan? You should consider a dual complete plan if you have special needs and if financially you qualify for Medicare and Medicaid. And here's why. 
It allows individuals to maximize the benefits that are available to them, many times at low or zero dollar premiums. And they may qualify also for a additional benefits such as dental, vision, hearing, over-the-counter benefits, and a healthy food card. Also with us today is Dr. Roland Reyna, founder of Health Texas. Hello there. Hey, Fiona. All right. Are dual complete plans available in our area? Absolutely. Uh, there are many people who qualify, as Glenda has stated. Uh, I'd encourage you to talk to uh, our representatives here, uh, our team partners with United to see if you qualify. But many people qualify don't even know about that. Uh, in terms of Health Texas, we've got uh, 17 locations where all of us accept the dual programs. Our doctors are highly uh, regarded both locally and, and, and nationally as well. Do you have any advice for seniors who may be lonely or depressed during the pandemic? I sure do. Um, I think that it's important that people talk to their doctors. They stay in contact with their doctors with their healthcare professionals. Actually, people are dying more of not getting cancer screening and having heart attacks and strokes because they're not keeping up with their doctors. Uh, the other thing I'd say is that people are living, people are actually dying more of fear than, than really of COVID. So I think we need to be optimistic and recognize that we have a vaccine very immediately on the, on the horizon. It'll probably be available sometime in March or April for the general population, starting at people who are at most at risk. So be positive about this. In addition to that, Go outside, spend time with your family. You can do it, uh, but be smart. Wear your mask, don't touch, stay six feet apart and be outside. If you can do those things, uh, spend time outside, uh, but do it smart, you'll be fine. But please don't die of fear. Hope is on and uh, we're on the way here. Things are happening. Well, Health Texas specializes in Medicare plans. For more information on Health Texas, just call 210-731-HTMG. That's 210-731-4864 or visit healthtexas.org. Dr. Reyna and Glenda, once again, thank you for your time and stay safe. All right, next on SA Live, well, aren't appetizers sometimes better than the main course? Yeah, oh, of yes. course. Leo Davila is back and he is taking chorizo to the next level with this great appetizer. Then individual cups and other ways to make it. Some blend in there. You're gonna love this, stick around. Welcome back everybody. Well, if you love comfort food, then you are going to love these recipes. And boy, this is gonna be perfect for you know, the family get together, something like yes. that, for all your Christmas uh, get togethers yeah. and holiday get togethers. Yes, and Chef Leo, of course, from Catch the Wave is back with another holiday recipe and we are making polenta two ways, right? Polenta two ways, okay. yes. So we love polenta, it's a underutilized, you know, uh, Mike, what did you call it earlier? The uh, fancy? Basic, basically, it's a... Um, French, yeah, French for cornmeal, right? <laughs> you know, we had a culinary instructor that said, put something French on it, you can charge $2 more. <laughs> so creamy polenta, uh, you want to cook it, it's really great. We added milk in there, a little bit of chicken stock, um, some butter to finish it. And same thing, we're getting ahead on it. So Mike's just reconstituting it. And then what's in front of Fiona is the second way. So this is my personal favorite. We're doing a bake and then we're doing a pan saute on it. So what we did was we took the same polenta that's still creamy, threw that onto a sheet tray with parchment right under it, and then we baked it off about 425 degrees for about 45 minutes. And all we wanted to do was just get it nice golden brown and delicious okay. right on top. Because we knew this was gonna be a second cooking application. Um, and then from here, once it's ready, Fiona cut it into beautiful squares, and now we're just gonna pan sear it. Um, you can add a touch of oil, or you can just do a nice non-stick pan and you're good to go. And, and even something like polenta, I mean, that can be served at breakfast time too. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. If you get these nice and thin and crispy, we use them as like chips. So almost do like a breakfast salsa. Oh, yeah. Really mean, nice play, that. just different just to have it. And, and it's like the it's the corn version of grits basically. Yes, it's absolutely. grits is hominy and this is and this is that. So you could you could use it for that. So Absolutely. Okay. And then yeah. on this side I'm just working in mushroom chorizo gravy. So how can you be from South Texas and not love, you know, beautiful chorizo? So we did is we did an all beef chorizo. We love baby bella mushrooms, that flavor it gets off. That's our favorite mushroom with sisal's really thin. Throw those in a pot, cook them down. Same thing, those greens, the white part of the green onion, mm -hmm. it's in there, a little bit of garlic, a little bit of onion. And all we're doing is we're just letting all those flavors get to know each other and hang out for a little bit. <laughs> so you've got, well. uh, okay. and this is, this is fantastic as well, little tip here. You've got mm -hmm. these small little uh, 
plastic cups. Absolutely, you know, it's like plastic ramekins. Yeah, just little ramekins, four ounce ramekins. You can use two ounce just for the social distancing of it all. Mm -hmm. If you want to grab and go for your friends and family, disposable, really easy, really fun. Like we talked about charcuterie, you can put out boards of this stuff. Ooh. Super fun, super easy to do. Yeah, well, those are some great tips for board. home cooks trying a recipe like this to remember things like that. Right? Yeah, so yeah, you know, for home cooks, I mean, we try to do something that's really accessible to everybody. Um, you know, we joke and we say we play with tweezers a lot. Is my goal not to have <laughs> tweezers out here you know, with a lot of fine dining, just some good food um, that everybody and anybody can do. So, well, and the other thing is too, you know, how many times they always say you eat with your eyes, and so when you have this, you know, this great little cup right here with that chorizo in there and just, I mean, look at how gorgeous that looks. And even the kids would, would like this. Oh, absolutely. And it's white cheddar cheese. You know, white cheddar cheese is my number one go-to. Oh and then God, pretty much it's really it. simple. So oh, wow. if you want to pass those to me too, oh, my and goodness then I'll gracious. finish it with the gravy. You've got to try that one there. And then we can, uh, I guess, actually the finish. Go no, pass the finish one. Yeah. All right, here we go. And once again, if uh, mm -hmm. folks want to, uh, Hit up your food truck. Where are you going to be? Yeah, so this Friday we're going to be at St. Paul Square at the Pop Up Market. Um, and then just stay locked into our social media. I promise we got some big things coming 2021. Um, and we're ready to see y'all. We're ready to serve. So if y'all just want to do cheese and green onions, okay. and that's ready to go. I could eat that polenta just in a giant bowl. It is, right? It's, it's, just, it's, like it's comforting, but it's a different play on comforting. Oh right? my goodness gracious. Beautiful. Leo, thank you. And for more information on Chef Leo Davila and Catch the Wave, go to our website, salive.com, and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. All right, coming up. You're never too old to play with toys. We're checking out some gadgets that are sure to be some of the hottest items this holiday season with some great prices. That's next on SA Live. <laughs> oh, welcome back to SA Live. Well, clothes may be great gifts, but let's face it. Kids probably want to have some fun with some toys. Look at this, look at this, I'm not even looking. Kids? <laughs> Dad does, I know. that's what kids are for, so you have an excuse to play with the toys for Christmas. Oh, we have some of the coolest and newest yep. gadgets for kids right here, and we're gonna test them out for you. And these are, they're great prices too for this stuff, okay? Yeah, a lot of times, you know, there we haven't seen any triple digits as far as uh, price. <laughs> She got me. So, so this is got, okay. So this is the laser tag game. Right. Okay. And all these products are from Sharper Image. Okay. And the laser tag shooting game includes two laser shooters, two adjustable chest plates, and it features blinking lights and sound effects. It's for kids eight and up. But who are we kidding? I and mean, look at that. Twenty nine ninety nine. Yes. At, That's at Walmart, it. Bed Bath and Beyond, Kohl's. CVS and Macy's is where you can find this. And the thing is too, it, it's got so many shots there and then you have to reset it and, and that is how the game ends. And this thing, you know, when you're hit because it, it vibrates on you as well. Yes. Move your hand, you're no, blocking. I'm not. <laughs> you're just blocking. <laughs> okay, I love okay. things. Is this my turn now with yes. this? Yes. Okay. okay, this is the Glow Drone for $39.99. Available, of course, at Walmart and Macy's, and come. And of course, you can also find it at Kohl's and Belk soon. I'm holding my breath because. Oh God! You, wait, oh, wait, 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 wait! Oh, come down, oh, come down. Easy, 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 easy. No, did no, you calibrate? No, back this way, back this way, back did this way. Did you calibrate? Whoa! <laughs> oh my gosh! Okay, so this 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 drone is. is I'm trying to. Hey, I, Darn it. Okay, it's gonna reset, it's gonna reset. Okay, this is the Sharper Image Glow Stunt Drone. So obviously you can see that it lights up in blue and green. Okay, those are super bright LEDs. See, you gotta find out which way is up or back. Well, apparently it's 360 degree stunting. Okay, it's also got a USB uh, charging option. Okay, I mentioned the LED lights. Now it does have safety landing pegs where you yeah. can land with ease and safety. I'm assuming that's if you're a really good mini drone pilot as well. Here we go, which here we go, here we go, now we're cooking. Are. Oh, wait, come back here. You gotta figure out which way is up, or back, or right, or left. Where is it? <laughs> Where is it? It's like those flies out there. <laughs> okay. okay, moving on to the next fun toy. <laughs> Okay, these are these are the, these are the the robots. Okay, remember Rock'em Sock'em Robots? That little game. Oh, this is like a thousand times above that. So, oh, wrong <laughs> controller on. here. Wrong controller. Okay, so you oh, 
Well, that was what we were about to say. So the RC Robot Combat Set, which you can find at Walmart, Kohl's, CVS, and JCPenney for 50 bucks, okay? You can do single punch, you can do double punch, and if you hit them both at the same time, it'll just keep going, and whichever robot gets knocked down first, the other person wins. Oh! Takes is a he alive? And keeps on ticking. Yeah. Is he still alive? Is I he still so. alive? Try it. Try it. Oh yes. Okay. Good. <laughs> you live to fight another day. <laughs> we'll see if you can come back. Oh no! You're not. You can't. You can't. Oh. Darn it. Oh man. Okay. okay you just threw that one. You he threw just that lost fight. It. He just yes. lost an epaulette. So okay. What's next? The, the last one is the <laughs> bump it. Oh, it's the uh, ro a road rage speed. Oh bumpers. yeah. These little okay. guys. So you get these two little little cars, okay? Oh, and the whole point, okay? The whole point is they have these little these little bumpers on you're them. Me. And you're over I here. can't see where I am. You're, you're where am I? Me. I'm the blue one. Where did I go? This is like Fiona in the parking lot. Oh, stop it! No. <laughs> anyway, the whole point is see if you can push, 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 push the side bumper so you can see what happens if you were to hit me. Mike, can I'm trying you push to. The, you're trying to. Okay. Oh, the side bumper. Yes, push the side bumper. Watch. Yes. Okay. So if you hit a wall or if you hit each other, you can pop the little driver out. <laughs> okay. And that, of For course, twenty four ninety nine. Twenty four ninety nine. That's it. Yeah. At Walmart, Kohl's, and coming soon to Bed Bath and Beyond. Perfect Too much fun. for dads on Christmas morning. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Go to our oh. website, SALive.com. Click on the Ask <laughs> on the SA Live tab. And if you're shopping at Kohl's, those sales might end today. So get, get on there. More information on these products, just head to our website, SALive.com, and click on the Ask Scene on SA Live tab. Next Back on SA way. Live. Darn it. Sweet sounds from Sierra Lynn. We hear the new single from this local singer-songwriter. You don't want to miss it. Welcome back to SA Live. Oh, look at that Christmas tree out there. The wind blowing and as the weather gets colder, a lot of us would rather kind of stay inside with a warm little blankie yes. than have to venture out. Yes, and that's where the folks with Favor and Circle K come in. Turns out you can have a lot more delivered to your home than just Polar Pops, you know, or coffee. coffee. Okay, turns out, how about some donuts too? Oh yeah. That looks tasty. Right? Well, yes, that. indeed. Hey, but there is a bunch of other stuff that you can order through Favor, and we have got our bags right here. Mm -hmm. What's in your bag? Let's see what we've got in here. Oh my gosh, there's oh, two liters of soda. Oh, wow. Soda, some big red. Okay, there's some condiments. We've got some ketchup. We've got some mustard. Oh, we got a monster energy drink. Okay, there's chicken salad. Oh, good. There is, oh wow, look at this. This is a, a beef charbroil with cheese. I, and there's also a ham and Swiss. Okay, we got a steak fajita taco and a chicken fajita taco. What? Yeah. And let's not forget some chips. That's fantastic. Mm -hmm. Okay, in my bag, I've got some great bags of, oh. whoops, there goes the coffee. Good thing I, uh, cherry sours, chips, and all that stuff. Uh -huh. And the what? piece de resistance, what did you get? folks. I got wine, I got what? beer. <laughs> Can I trade you? I have some energy drinks and some condiments. <laughs> yeah. Here, we'll trade. You can have the cherry sours. Thank you, the cherry so, sours. Thank okay, you so this much. Is, wow, this is fantastic. Okay. All so. Right. And all you have to do is download the app. Uh, in favor, scroll down to Circle K, pick out what you want, check out. And when you download it today, you get unlimited free deliveries for the first two weeks. Just visit favordelivery.com slash promos for details. That was so convenient. Yeah. You know what else is really convenient? Mm. Free gas for a year. No way. Yeah, way. Just look for the secret word every day on Good Morning San Antonio. I love watching that show <laughs> at 6 a.m. And you can enter for a chance to win daily free gas for a year and other prizes. Just enter the secret word at K ksat.com slash circle K. All right, now to a performance by a local musician. Yep, Sherry Sierra Lynn, pardon me, is a local singer-songwriter blending soul, blues, and rock and roll. Her new album is out now and available on iTunes, Amazon, Spotify, and more. Catch her this Saturday night at Backyard on Broadway at 7 p.m. Here's a snippet of her new single, Fight. What's got you thinking this world owes you something? Well, baby, I got news. You gotta pay your dues. 
You think this world's just gonna hand you what you want Where you're wrong Can't you see all your hate and negativity will get you nowhere? Do you take responsibility? You'll be alone, lost at sea. Again, that was local singer-songwriter Sierra Lynn. Her new album is out now and available on iTunes, Amazon, Spotify, and more. Hey, tomorrow on SA Live, if you get the perfect Christmas gift, make sure you know how to wrap it. We share wrapping techniques for those really odd-shaped presents. And get the top gear for this year's hunting season from local experts. That and more tomorrow at 1 on SA Live. All right, we asked you earlier, did you shop for yourself or for others on Black Friday and Cyber? <clears throat> Sorry. Me, I'm trying to read here, Cyber Monday. All right, Jacob says, I love to shop online is the best way. Well, yeah. Yeah, both. Both, okay, she, Lisa right. shopped for herself and others. I love all the Very emojis nice, there Lisa. too. And mm -hmm. kids and wife for, wow, Adam. Good job, Adam. Yeah, that's right, that's, that's what you say. That's the correct answer. Because he knows his wife is watching, so. Okay, I'm trying to adjust the speed on this thing. Okay, he, Mike has not gotten any better as a drone pilot. Oh, wait, 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 you haven't crashed yet. This is, this is, oh, you're skimming the, hang, oh, hang. that's it. I can't, I, you're done. That is not a good it's sound. That,